So the question is, which has a greater electronegativity, magnesium or oxygen? So we have the periodic table here divided up into electronegativity values. They're listed below each element. So magnesium here in group two, 1.31. Oxygen, 3.44. Oxygen is much more electronegative than magnesium. And that makes sense. This is a non-metal here, and we have a metal. Metals tend to be lower. The trend as you go across, electronegativity increases. As you go up a group, it increases. And the most electronegative element on the periodic table is fluorine. So you kind of can just see which one of these is closer to fluorine, and oxygen's right there. Another way we can visualize this is in three dimensions. So right here would be fluorine, and then magnesium, that's right here. This is magnesium. So again, you can see the trends increasing as we go across, and as we go up, fluorine's the most. And we don't even list the noble gases here because they don't really form bonds. If you subtract, so if you have 3.44 minus 1.31, you get 2.13. And since that's over 2, or sometimes people say 1.75, when magnesium and oxygen form a bond, because that electronegativity is so big, that difference, we'll get an ionic bond. You also can say you have a metal and a nonmetal, and that would mean you have an ionic bond as well. That's it. This is Dr. B looking at the difference in electronegativity between Mg and O. Thanks for watching.